Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV, a station where you watch and learn. Your tutor is Mr. Wanyoike, an agriculture teacher. On Agriculture Form 1, Lesson 5, the topic will be factors influencing agriculture and subtopic is biotic factors. On to our lesson objective, by the end of this lesson, you should be able to explain the various biotic factors that influence agriculture. And some of the biotic factors uh, that influence agriculture include the first one we have the pests and parasites, the second one decomposes the third one nitrogen fixing bacteria, the fourth one pathogens, the fifth one predators, and finally we have the pollinators. Uh, these are some of the images of the biotic factors that influences agriculture. And therefore, to start with, I will start with the effect of pests on crop. As you can see on these diagrams here, there are several pests and they have really damaged the crop in the field, as you can see. And what are the effects of these uh, pests? The first one is they feed on part or the whole plant. The second one, they transmit diseases to the crop. And the third one causes injuries to plants. And the fourth one is increase the cost of production because the farmer has to buy for the herbicides and also to buy for the pesticides, which are normally used in the farm to control the pests in the farm. And we have effect of parasites. A parasite is an organism which will attack the animal in the farm and therefore they may end up destroying the quality and also lowering the quality of the agricultural produce. And one of the main uh, parasites that attack dairy animals, we have, or animals in the farm, we have the tick, and you can see that there is a Frisian here, and also there is an, another cow here, which is really uh, affected by tick. And effect of parasite on livestock, we are going to look the first one, transmission of diseases. For example, tick may cause the ECF, that is East Coast Fever. The second one, we have lowering the level of production and pests normally suck the blood and therefore weaken the immune system of the animal. And to an extent, it lowers the level of production. The other one, lowering the quality. Uh, those animals which are heavily attacked by the parasite normally produce quality of low, quality uh, which are low as compared to those animals which are healthy. The other one we have raises the cost of production because there are so many chemicals the farmers must buy to, in order to control the parasite during livestock production. Effect of decomposers, uh, that is also decomposers and nitrogen fixing bacteria. These are also the biotic factors which influence agriculture. For example, decomposers helps in decomposition of organic uh, material or matter in the soil and therefore contributing to addition of soil fertility. The second one, we have roles of nitrogen fixing bacteria. Nitrogen convert the free nitrogen in air into nitrates, which is normally absorbed by the plant roots. We have effect of pathogen, that pathogen is also another biotic factor that influence agriculture. And what is a pathogen? A pathogen is a, a disease causing microorganism. And therefore we have two types of pathogens. We have uh, crop pathogens, those are disease causing microorganism that causes diseases to crops. And also we have animal pathogenic uh, organism. Those are the ones which normally causes diseases to uh, to animals. Then we have the effect, they transmit diseases. The other one, they lower both the quality and the quantity of agricultural produce. Then uh, we go to the effect of predators in agriculture. And predators, uh, pred predators is an animal that kill another animal for food. And the animal which is normally killed is called a prey. And there are two classification of predators based on 
uh, ben be the benefit they impose to the agriculture and also the harmful effect they impose to the agriculture. And therefore, we have beneficial predator and also harmful predator. The beneficial predator, as we can see here, we have a uh, uh, cheetah here, uh, is a beneficial to some extent because it will kill on the antrop, which the antrop on the, ha the hand normally de destroy the crops in the field. They normally consume the agricultural crops which are grown by the man. And therefore, by cheetah eliminating uh, the antrop by f catching it and feeding on it, it will reduce the, the level of destruction caused by the antrop in the field. And also we have some birds here. Uh, they normally feed on tick, and therefore they will eliminate the tick, which normally uh, transmit diseases to livestock. For example, as I said, the East Coast fever, which is a disease which is transmitted by the tick. Uh, then we can go to the, uh, the negative predation. The, uh, on the other side, the negative predation, that is whereby uh, an example, we have the hawk feeding on uh, chick, uh, ch chicken or poultry in the farm. And this hawk will uh, kill the birds which are normally reared in the fa farm and therefore worldling agricultural production as you can see on the diagram here. There is a, a chicken which has already been killed by the hawk. Then effect of pollinators, we have pollinators are those organisms which normally uh, transfer the pollen grain from one flower to another. And they are categorized into two classes. We have the insects and also the birds and the effect pollination. Then uh, today's lesson, I will leave you with a few questions. Uh, one question actually, and the question which I'm going to uh, leave you with is explain any four ways in which biotic factors influence agriculture. And therefore, if you'd like to uh, to, to, for reference, you can refer to, from Kelby, that is Secondary Agriculture Student Book 2, which is written by the Kenya uh, Literature Bureau, that, that is the publisher. And for more information, you can reach us through the contacts which are displayed here. Uh, you can use the SMS, the, as you can see the number is well illustrated there. And also you can reach us through the Facebook and the Facebook is at Elimu TV. And finally, you can use the Twitter, and that is at Elimu TV underscore KE. Thank you for watching us. May God bless you.